if I may say as an outsider, I think the British Army needs to be more resourced. I get that the Navy and the Air Force both have a long ways um, are, are being resourced as they should, um, but the Army, the British Army is being asked to do so much. Um, I don't know that they're getting all the resources they need to do what's asked. Now, a lot of credit goes to the Alliance. Uh, at the NATO summit uh, in Wales three years ago, um, all 28 nations agreed that they needed to spend more. And they all agreed that the target of 2% within 10 years, so that would be uh, 2024. So we're still seven years away from that. And I have seen a lot of countries um, either already reach that 2%, Romania, uh, Lithuania, uh, Poland, all three should be at it or um, above it by the end of this year. Uh, other countries are moving in the right direction, so uh, that's encouraging. There was a lot of talk at this conference yesterday about the UK's army numbers and talk of possible cuts. Mm -hmm. You mentioned how important it is that UK, the UK leads the way in NATO and shows leadership and strength. Do you think the British Army is big enough? Do you think that cutting it would be dangerous? Absolutely. It's, it's not big enough to do everything that is needed uh, to do as part of the alliance or to, to do all the other things uh, that it's asked to do. Um, I mean, the UK has global responsibilities just like the United States. Um, you're one of only, only three countries increased their uh, troop footprint uh, in Afghanistan when the United States did uh, back uh, in 2010. The UK was one of the three. Um, so you have such an important role in Africa, in the Middle East, uh, in the Pacific, uh, and of course uh, in Europe. Uh, that All the people of the world, every single one of them, lives on the land. It's where all the people are, it's where all the critical infrastructure is, so you have to have land forces to protect infrastructure, to protect populations. So um, I think, uh, again, I'm the outsider here, uh, I'd be very worried if uh, British land forces were cut below what I thought was described as the floor.